Ronald, the rules lawyer here. In the spirit of the holidays, I've decided to share a gift with you all. When I'm not a lawyer, I teach an after-school middle school program that learns tabletop RPGs like D&D, Pathfinder, and Starfinder. And a teacher learns to devise tricks to get their kids' attention and to help them remember things. And I'll demonstrate one of my tricks in this video. I remember a student who was having trouble with her rogue and couldn't remember all the ways she could get sneak attack damage, which requires that the target of your attack be flat-footed, a condition in Pathfinder 2E. When a player with a rogue feels they're not doing well, I assume the player's role and teach through show and tell. And to aid in their retention, I accompany with song. 12 simple examples. Pretty soon they sing along. Because I hit before and you acted after me That made you flat-footed to me On the second round of combat my rogue cackled with glee Hit behind a pillar and that made you flat-footed to me On the third round of combat my rogue cackled with glee when the fighter charged you, I moved in to flank you, and that made you flat-footed to me. On the fourth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee, ready the reaction, lest she join the action, mutual satisfaction, for that made you flat-footed to me. On the fifth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee, I landed a crit. Your feet were flat before I hit you with my sword until my next turn starts. You will be flat footed to we. On the sixth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. Struck you with my dagger, psych, that was a feint. Until I make you strike, unless I roll to crit, in which case it lasts longer, you will be flat-footed to me. On the seventh round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. I look surprised, and I point behind you at a diversion. Because I made you look, you simply fail to see my dagger in your eyes. Guess I made you flat-footed to me. On the eighth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. The fighter doesn't hit you, instead she tries to trip you. Reflex doesn't save you, and that makes you prone. Hard to move around, your attacks go down. Sucks to hit the ground, and what's more, you're flat-footed to me. On the ninth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. Snakey joined the fray, grappled you like prey. Your fort's just okay, here you have to stay because you've been grabbed. You're not looking great, hard to manipulate, and you have to escape. Until then, you're flat footed to me. On the tenth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. First I go hide, sneak and set of stride, one and two another, if I end in cover, and my stealth is better, you still can't see me. Nothing you can do, until I am through sneak attacking you, until then you're flat footed to me. On the eleventh round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. Feet make situations, twin fate with two weapons, mastermind who studies, gang up with my buddy, just Stiker when you're frightened, blind fight when it's dark, and there are many more. Find me, you can try, hidden now am I, you are gonna die, I have made you flat footed to me. On the twelfth round of combat, my rogue cackled with glee. So many spells do the same as well. Darkness makes you blind, grapple you with vines, or create confusion. See the confused condition, flanking situations. Who said magic's weak? Arguments are lame, this is a team game. Better I became, since with magic you're flat-footed to me.